Hello everyone at home, my name is Matthew Murphy. We're here at New York Comic Con 2015 with Comicsverse. I'm speaking with a Qbert School graduate, Ernesto Sende. How are you doing, Ernesto? Hello, Matthew. Thank you. I'm being doing really good, enjoying the show and everything. This is the third day, pretty busy. Friday was busy. I don't know. I'm just here. All right. Well, are you showcasing any of your work today? Yes. Uh, well, my main objective coming to the con, uh, especially since I just graduated, I mean, not. I graduated in May 2014, but uh, yeah, I do want to like show my work to some uh, artists or maybe some editors to get feedback and you know grow as an artist because you never stop growing and there's a lot of stuff I, ha I still have to work on so yeah well you were telling me about your work earlier I know you work with social paintball or paintball company and you're working on a comic with them can you tell us more about that project for sure uh, well the comic book is called bunker like a bunker you know like you, you cover with it and uh, um, yeah so the social paintball is uh, like a pretty big company in, in the paintball media but for the fans you know like it's it's uh, like a fan based thing I mean, they're pretty recognized and stuff. And the owner saw some of my work. He was really like interested in it because he wanted to do comic for a long time now. And then he saw me and he was like, he was just like, sorry. He was just like, hey, you know, I want you to do comics. Can you do it now? And I'm like, I guess I could, you know? So I started working for the comic book, uh, for, for this guy, uh, doing the comic book as homework for my teachers as well. So, you know, I worked stuff out and now I'm doing it. Right. And, uh, you were also telling me, like, as a graduate, you also got noticed by an independent film company. You're doing concept art as well. How was the transition from working with from comics to concept art? Well, uh, between films and comics, uh, they're like cousins. You know what I mean? They're very like close together in terms of like composition and like design, and all the elements are like pretty much the same. So I got contact by this uh, friend of mine who, who was about to graduate from this school. is the Columbia College in Chicago. It's a film school. And they were working in their thesis projects, so they needed a storyboard artist. And I, well, I just went uh, with them for the storyboards. But working for them opened the doors for, uh, you know, op opened me the doors to work for more people. They were like doing all these other short films, and they needed some concept artists. So I started doing concept art for them and everything. And the, the different thing was that for comics, I, I was working very traditional, and for these guys, I'm doing like very digital stuff. You know, digital paintings, digital like lines and everything it's it's close but it's a bit different but it's it's no problem for me you know we got trained for this at the Kubert school so i think i'm kind of like ready for the hits you know and as your work working specifically uh, like learning at the Kubert school and working on film has that helped like like has you did you go in with a certain style and you come out with another well uh, i'm i'm not gonna like i i wouldn't think i i just came in with a different style than the one i graduated i just think i just grew as an artist you know uh, as artists, I think we all have like a way to draw, so that's just that just develops and you just like keep fixing stuff and correcting and growing as an artist. But the way you draw could be or is always the same. You just do it better. You know what I mean? Like because it's always like working on your anatomy, working on your composition and stuff. Like the way you draw things, they teach you how to draw things. So your style is the same because your hands are the same. The, the way you think it's the same, but you just grow and just just polish your your style. That's what I think at least. I like that. Well, um, is there anything that you'd like to plug in, say, that's coming out soon in the future for you? Um, well, hopefully finish this painful comic book, Bunkered. And uh, yeah, I, I do really want to get more into, fil into, into the film industry. Like, I really like the comic book industry. It's a tough place, a lot of competition also in the film industry. But I'm really interested to try out more like character design, concept art, like digital paintings, matte paintings, stuff like that. So... I don't know. I think it's just my hunger of experimenting different styles and like different environments. But yeah, I, if it's hard, I'm it. All right, man. I'm looking forward to seeing more from you. But well, thank you. Thank you for talking with us today. Uh, everyone at home, my name again, Matthew Murphy. We're here at New York Comic Con. Speaking, uh, I'm from Comics First. You can check out more videos like this on comicsfirst.com and on our Facebook page. Uh, follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Comics First or both. Tumblr, tumblr.com slash comicsverse, and have a great con, guys. Looking forward to seeing you again.